Hey, this is Matt with Eurocam TV. Uh, one question we get a lot is about base coats for your candy projects. And which one should you use? Which one works best? Uh, there's really not a solid answer to that. Basically, you use whatever you like, depending on what you want to get out of your candy bake job. So this is Stellar Silver. The Stellar Silver is going to be our most popular metallic base coat that we do for candy projects there. That's included in the basic car kit and motorcycle kits there. It gives you a really nice coarse metallic effect so you get some nice sparkle out of it you get a good nice reaction when the sun hits it as you can see here through the candy but not overwhelming okay very nice traditional candy look if you're looking for something a little more subtle you can get that out of the s302 fine silver metallic not quite as sparkly as the coarse metallic Still gives you a really nice candy effect here. You get the good depth color out of it. It's kind of nice and smooth metallic without being over the top dramatic. And again, that just completely depends on what you want to do. You know, what are you looking for out of your candy? If you really want to spice it up, you can add some metal flake to your stellar silver base coat. And see what you get there. Uh, you're going to get a lot more sparkle, a lot more flake reaction out of that, okay? Again, totally up to you. Uh, if you're going to use this blue candy, one thing you can do is a royal blue metallic. That'll really help with your coverage. It'll really help uh, kind of blend your candy with your base coat there so you don't get striping and uh, you don't see your fading as bad over time, okay? You might want to go with a gold base coat. Again, that's popular. Sunset G212, Sunset Light Gold. It's a nice coarse metallic. Again, you get your nice reflection out of that. Good depth. Or if you want something a little more subtle, you can go with the Egyptian gold. This is a popular base coat for the candies. People just like the way it looks. Totally up to you. This one's going to give you a little more of a green effect. See it through there a little bit. It's going to darken it up just a little bit. Totally up to you. Do a side by side comparison. So there's a teal metallic for stellar silver. Place it over the gold. A little more green out of it. Darkens it just a little bit. Not overly dramatic, but different. Have a look at the Asiatic blue over stellar silver. over the gold. Darkens it up just a little bit. Nothing dramatic, but it is different. Again, totally up to you. Do whatever you want to do with it. That's the beauty of candy. You can do a lot of different stuff with these. One thing you might want to do is see a graphic or a stripe down the middle or on the side. Use the gold to make your graphics all in your base coat and you spray the same candy over the top of them. You get a different effect. Uh, one popular Color, color options we see is the Stellar Silver and Charcoal. I don't have the charcoal here with me today, but that generally makes a nice effect if you want something like a stripe under your candy or, or a different color graphic. So again, you can use anything you want as a base coat here. You decide what you want your candy to do, and you pick from there. Thanks for joining us here on Eurochem. Leave a like, let us know what you want to see next, and we'll work on it for you.